Carthage's log. Um, I've made it back to Earth. I've lost contact with the other lions. My lion turned into a human. <laughs> and I'm going to this thing called Awesome Con. We're on awesome. our way to Awesome Con in DC. <laughs> Here we go. Please pray we can park. <laughs> Please pray there's no tornado because there's a tornado warning today. Yes, I don't want to blow away. Um, <laughs> yeah, first time putting on makeup with Pidge. Her makeup is really simple, you can see. No contacts because my alarm went off. Okay, what was I saying? I can't um, see out my mirror. Spirit family yeah. keep our house and cars and animals safe. Okay. And us. Anyway, um, no contacts today because Pidge's eyes are brown. The first character I've ever cosplayed with my natural eye color. Your lion's so. eyes are brown too. Um, <laughs> actually, lion's eyes are yellow, but mine are brown. Lion. <laughs> I have a lion plushie. I don't want to be John. I have my space caterpillar. <laughs> I love these little guys. I want you to make me one. Um. Well, my mom's gonna be wearing the lion plushie on her shoulder, and I get to carry around my caterpillar. It's for little trash baby. Uh, so it's raining out here. Yeah, it's I hope it doesn't pour on rain. us walking from the garage. Cause. Me too, because I sp hair sprayed the heck out of this hair. I have crispy, crunchy hair, and if people get close, they may get their eye poked out. <laughs> and my bangs came out good and today. And I got this to go up here like this. <laughs> oh, I was gonna bring two rain hats in front of my purse. I didn't. There's know. an umbrella in my bag in the trunk. Okay, but if it's lightning, you can't use it. It has metal. Yeah, I know. That looks so funny. Look at the little thing up there. Yep. Anyway, I am ready to go as Pidge because I just binge watched the entire season of Ultron last night and I finished at 1 a.m. and I am not awake. <laughs> I only have one more season to go and then I've watched the entirety of Voltron. Oh my god. I have a question. Season seven's finale was huge. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Um, can you get the navigator up while you're doing that? I mean, can it talk to us while you're doing that? No, but I was about to end the vlog here because people don't care about us driving in the car and I'm probably going to end oh, it wait, halfway Oh, wait, I have now. to ask them a question. Yes. They're out there on TV land or wherever <laughs> you are, computer land. Yeah. Um, don't you think that she kind of looks like Velma from Scooby-Doo? I don't think so. I do. <laughs> I think it's your hair shape. I think it's because Velma also has that hair shape and glasses. Yeah, that's what I but think. But Velma wears orange, not green. <laughs> but your hair shape and glasses. Although like it brings up the point that um, Paige is very nerdy, and so is Velma. So uh, maybe they could have been friends if they were from the same universe. Although Voltron can jump through interreality rifts, so maybe they can meet up one day. Maybe they're connected in a weird way. I don't think they're connected, but I think that they could possibly meet one day. Um, well, if Voltron hadn't ended. But yeah. Uh, <laughs> tonight is She-Ra, so I won't be watching season 8 of Voltron tonight because I'm going to start on She-Ra. What time does that come on? It's on Netflix. It probably dropped it already at midnight. Oh. Um, <laughs> so... Also, it's Lesbian Day of Visibility, and She-Ra's new season came out, and coincidence? I don't think so. It's very gay, and I am here for Cachadora, and there better be Cachadora in the new season. <laughs> anyway, I gotta get up our GPS. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I've spotted some of the Voltron lions. They've been turned into statues. The other one is sort of hidden. They've been turned into <laughs> statues. I just took a picture. <laughs> okay. Now you can see my whole cosplay. <laughs> the whole cosplay. Everything is fine. Even the shoes. I'm so proud of these shoes that I made. Everything is automatic. You touch nothing. Yeah. My hair is still you, There's no I paper made. towels, by the way. Doesn't my hair look good still? Yeah. The lion's falling off your shoulder. I'm out. We still fall. Anyway, uh, someone already recognized me as Pidge, so that was cool. It was in the elevator. Anyway, probably vlog more later. Everything cause... is automatic. Oh, there is paper towels. Yeah, and it's automatic. You take one and gives you another. Anyway, I'm gonna vlog more later because bathroom vlogging is weird. <laughs> take a video of that. We are in a, an actual panel <laughs> for once. You just said you wanted pizza. 
<laughs> I turned off the camera when you said that. Are you filming? We're, now? Yeah, we're in an actual panel for once. I never go to panels, but I'm cosplaying Voltron, and there's a Voltron panel today. So. Are you gonna do the vlogging when I'm River and you're somebody else? Tomorrow? Yeah, I'm vlogging all weekend. <laughs> So anyway, really <laughs> just a short update because I didn't vlog all day. We had another tornado warning people. Yeah, we had a tornado warning while we were down in the dealer's hall. So that was something. Why do our heads look so huge? I'm holding it close so I don't get people in it who don't want to be in it. Oh, okay. Uh, there's still that guy in the background. I mean, looking at my head, it looks like I don't need any pizza. <laughs> Anyway, short update. I'm gonna go until after the panel. I'm probably not gonna film during the panel because I'm listening. Bye. Bye. I'm so tired. I can hardly see straight. Okay. <laughs> I can't even see my face on the camera. I hope I can I drive. I can't either, but for different reasons. I don't usually wear glasses, and these are not prescription lenses, but they're slightly very magnified, and at the end of the day, yeah, everything's blurry. I can't see anything either because I'm just too tired. All I see is colors. We're sitting on the stairs. <laughs> there was nowhere else to sit nearby. We can't make another Well, step. I mean, there is. It's right over there, but we kind of sat on the stairs instead. People, I have sciatica. This isn't easy. <laughs> um, we went to that Voltron panel and learned about Voltron and their sciences, and apparently, Almost mm -hmm. everything that Voltron teaches you scientifically is correct. Almost. So, there was only one thing they got wrong, and that's the only thing they got wrong was calling our galaxy a solar system. So it wasn't like scientific like things. And I learned we all live, well this area lives in the Milky Way, and I did not know that. You didn't know that? No, I did not know that. Okay. Um, I may have been taught a hundred years ago. Remember yes, I graduated our, in Our galaxy is called the Milky Way. <laughs> I and know uh, she was telling me during the panel she's afraid that we're going to get sucked into a black hole. <laughs> uh, that is going to happen. We are going to collide with Andromeda, but not for like a long, long, long time. I'll be gone. We're all going to be dead. <laughs> it's well, future generations. Well, we might be dead and then come back and then get sucked into It's it. future generations who are going to collide with Andromeda. I also <laughs> think Doctor Who is very scientifically correct because Somewhat. I've seen things checked out that they have said there too. Yeah, I'm not all the way. None of it is. It's science yeah, fiction. Yeah, it's not Most, science. mostly everything about Voltron was correct though, which is cool. A lot on Doctor <laughs> Who is correct too. Yeah, so in review of our day, I got to put on a NASA jacket, which was really cool mm. to do. Um, and we wanted to. And go... we made fidget spinners. No, they're these fidget string toys. I think my. my he called them be fidget in my spinners. Pocket. No, he Mine's called them a fidget string. He said it was going to be Cinderella. This. And then you fidget around with it. You move the beads from one end to the other. And you can make it like a bracelet. Okay, so we went to... You can to, make patterns. We went to story time. And the guy running story time was the one who taught us how to make We these. really went so to they, Kung Fu. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we went to go see a martial arts Fake, act. Um, fix the pattern. Yeah. I made rainbow. Now the loops um. make a pattern. But we really went to Kung Fu, but it would end up to be story time. Yeah. Which was okay with me, except he had us he jumping around. He had us around. moving and doing, like, <laughs> activities. And I wanted to sit. It was right after I ate lunch. What lunch? You had a protein bar. <laughs> protein bar is more protein than I get in a lunch in a day That's true. Anyway. That's so, true. So, uh, now I think we're going to go take some pictures in the arcade because Paige likes video games and it would be cute photo shoot. And then probably go home and have dinner. And it was like really hot in here in the beginning, yeah. and now it's like freezing. Yeah, I put I my think sweater the storms back on. rolled through. Yeah, and then tornado uh, warning is over now. We're gonna come back again tomorrow because I live close enough that we just drive into the convention every There's day. There's a furry. Oh yeah. Uh, <laughs> I saw a furry. Anyway, um, ending for today on the vlog. We just waved to the furry. Yeah, ending for today on the vlog. Bye. Bye.
dark in here. I don't know if this is going to come out. There's the top of Pidge's head on the right. And the screen, of course, up above. I wish they'd pick a song already. Pick a song already, people. <laughs> Who's picking the song anyway? There's Pidge. Hey, Pidge! Pidge, turn around and wave. Oops, <laughs> she can't because it's starting. You can't hear it, so you don't know. 